So you want to know how to prank. Today I'm with Taras Cool, and we're going to show you back to school prank gadgets. Let's do it. Alright, the very first prank we're going to show you guys that is perfect for back to school is my magic snake in the can prank. <laughs> There's a huge three Ooh. foot spring snake inside this can. Check it out. When they open it up. Oh, yes, look at this. This thing is awesome. It's three foot giant spring snake. Wow. You jam it inside this little can right here. It, fits it looks like a snake too. Yeah, and it's super surprising. They never expect it. But when someone looks at this can, they maybe get a little bit suspicious, right? So this will fit inside of any can like this. Perfect to put it inside the Pringles can. Am I doing it right? Yeah, man, you're just jamming it right That was in my there. first time, it's easy. Yeah, so you just jam that spring snake right inside this can right here. The cool part is you're gonna put this little seal right back on top, make it look like it's brand new. Never I mean, know. nobody usually take them off. I usually, usually keep them just in case, you know? There you go, Next that is seal. perfect, right? It's sealed up. Okay, we now you open Pringles. it. It's sealed up. We got some Pringles, perfect to give your friend. Hey man, have some in class. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! It's That's always the best. Me. Even though I, I hate it even more when I know it's coming. It's such a fun prank. They never expect it. I... <laughs> <laughs> man! <laughs> you actually uh, did that prank on Bob. He freaked out, but yeah. he pointed the can at me and it hit me instead. Yeah. So this is a great prank to pull on your friends at school. They'll never expect it. Everyone's gonna laugh. They're gonna love it and they're gonna want you to do more of it. So definitely check this one out. Best way to put the snake in there, you take it and then you're just gonna take the springs and pop them in this way. That's it. So you don't bend the springs, you don't wanna break it. You just oh, push that's it fast. In. Boom, hold it like that, keep that seal, get this cap, pop it on there, it's ready to go. Oh. <laughs> Another back to school prank gadget, perfect to get a good jump out of somebody, is the scare spider box. This thing is amazing. It totally scares anybody that has no idea what this is. So if somebody is unfamiliar with this, when they open it, boom! The spider comes out, it literally touches their finger. It's jiggly, it moves, it makes it really extra spooky. It is such a good prank. You will even get your friends that even know what it is and they're just kind of like opening it up anyways because it just jumps out at them. It's such a good one. There's so many different ways you can set this up. My favorite though is to use it as a gift. You go, hey, here you go, teacher or friend's birthday. You put a gift card inside. You should wrap it up too to make it even more spicy. So, can you show me how this thing works? Or what it's supposed to do exactly? What is it? I think as a bird feed or <laughs> Yeah, yeah, you wrap it up, put the gift card inside. When they open up and get the gift card, they get a big jump, you get a good laugh. Everyone's gonna that's love it. That's a good it. idea. Yeah, man. Having a gift card in there, that's a really good idea. So that way you prank them, but they still get the gift. Wow, I didn't even think about it. So the next gadget we got here, very classic neck popper. I really love this one. Yeah, there you go. Besides that, this is like a fidget toy. It's very satisfying. I had one. I played with this thing non-stop till I broke it. Oh, did you? Yeah, but what you do is like, oh, oh my neck hurts, man. You take this popper, right? And then what you're gonna do is you compress it. Yep. Sounds like bones popping. Pull it back open. This is the satisfying part. Mm -hmm. Ross is talking about. Watch, ready? Oh. Now it's like this, you just gotta peel it back open. Like that. Boom, 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 now it's ready to go. Another good way to do it is like, oh, my elbow that sounds, my elbow kind of hurts, coach. I don't know what happened. Oh. Oh, how about the nose, broken nose? Oh, nice, dude. Oh. That's a good one. I never did the nose with this. I usually use crunchy noodles, but. Oh, yeah. Once you pop it, super easy to put it back together. 
and set off another punk. It's a great one to pull at school because this will fit right in your pocket. No one will know. Neck popper is one of my favorite pranks to pull on people. It definitely gets a reaction. They're not gonna suspect it's actually this little crazy toy and you're gonna get a good reaction out of it. So, ooh, perfect for back to school pranks. For the next gadget, this is very simple one, especially for those people who love to boil your pen. Guess what? You get yourself shock pen. It's a little electric pen that is going to scare somebody but not hurt them. So what you do is just give it to somebody. They make a of pens, they, they give you the pen, they're gonna go, ah! <laughs> oh, it works. I did a whole video where I got all these YouTubers with it, trying to get their signature. Oh, I've seen that one. So if you go to like one of those YouTube cons or Instagram con, VidCon, whatever, you wanna go get one of these and go to one of your favorite YouTubers for a signature, you give it to them, they'll never know that they're gonna get a shock pen. Oh my god. And gosh. you can prank your favorite YouTuber. They're gonna be so Woo. mad. Maybe don't do that. <laughs> no, they'll love it. They're gonna laugh. You're gonna have it on camera. It doesn't even matter if you get their signature. What really matters is you got their reaction on the video. Yo, Lance over here just busted his hand. I'm sure you saw it in the Scoot Ninja. So, uh, well, I want you to sign my arm with your left hand. Sign with the Shock pen prank gadget. Perfect for back to school. Catch! What do you do every time you go in into the dark room? You flip the switch automatically. Well, get yourself a fake, very realistic snake and just hang it like this. Oh, so when they come into class, do it for the teacher. That'd be a good yeah, one. Yeah, they just automatically go in there, touch the snake, and look, whoa! Yeah, that would scare the crap out of anybody. First of all, they're gonna wanna know what the heck this thing is. Secondly, why, what snake crawls on walls? Is that a spider snake? Yeah, <laughs> it looks cool. It's gonna scare them no matter what. Yeah, that's definitely freaky, especially if you go to touch a switch and you feel something on your hand, you're gonna look at it and it's gonna be so scary to see, especially if it drops on the floor. And you're oh, gonna yeah. be like, oh my gosh, that scared the crap out of me. And another good one to use with these snakes, right? They're super realistic. These are the best prank snakes you can get anywhere. They're super rubbery, they look real, and what you do is you put it in your friend's backpacks or your bags. Just put the snake right there inside, especially if they're not looking, and then when they open their bag to go in, they feel it, maybe they see it, ooh, it just moved down there. Another good one you could do is clip it to the backpack, maybe. Ooh, on the yeah, string, on so the they string. start moving it, so like put yeah. it under the bag, and clip it with this thing so when they pick out backpack it start falling with them. Ooh, you they, should do that one. Yeah, it's a good one, right? Yeah, like you that? should do it on a YouTube video. So you put it under the backpack, they lift it up, but there's a little sting, you'll pull it behind the backpack and they run away and they're chasing him. Yeah, that's, that's a, a good, good one. one. You like that? That's there's a whole bunch of ideas you can do. So those are back to school prank gadgets you can pull on your friends. Let us know what you thought about these ones in the comments below. Which one was your favorite, Ross? Honestly, the snake and uh, the spider box. I love that one a lot. I like the spider box, the shock pen, the bone poppers. You like the them all. I, I like them all. I, I like them, but I think the spider box is number one. Oh, the chips might be number two. Oh yeah, <laughs> chips is really good. They're too. really good. Nobody ever awesome. expects it. It's really awesome. Thank you so much for hanging out with us, checking out these prank gadgets. I hope you guys like them. If you do, you can get your own at prankkits.com. I sell them all in my prank kit store. And we're gonna give away this spider box in this video. Bone poppers, the snake, the shock pen, and the chips. I'm gonna give everything that you saw in this video away. All you gotta do is leave a comment down below. Let us know which one of these pranks is your favorite. Leave a comment down below suggesting a new prank we should do. Just leave a comment, because I'm gonna pick it, and I'm gonna pick my favorite ones. I'm not gonna pick a random one, I'm gonna read them. Also, everybody, Taras started a new channel. It's a pet channel. All his pets are on that channel. 
amazing videos. We just filmed one with his dogs, it's so good. Go check it out, link is in the description. I'll make sure you guys subscribe to his new pet channel. Link is in the description. Live inspired, shock the world. We'll see you next time.